Hi, Paul Richardson here from Witchwood Tackle and Broad Oak Trout Lakes in Worcestershire. The month is May and we have some fantastic sunshine in the air. And that temperature is going to help one thing and that's the hatch of the Mayfly Nymph. Especially during the afternoon time, it's a key time to start fishing the dun patterns, which are the patterns that sit on the top of the surface of the water in the surface film. Now the best way to fish for those is a simple setup using your floating line, which you'll all be familiar with. Here I've gone with a lightweight outfit, so this is only a 10 foot 3 weight, which is exceptionally light. Um, but you probably stand to fish this on normally a 5 weight rod. Uh, fishing any distances from the margins into the middle of the lake, the mayfly nymph will hatch off and touch all parts of the water. Just look for rising trout splashing around. You'll see these quite often. Huge flies on the surface. Frequent takes. Put your fly over the top of one of these fish and fishing as static as you can. If you're getting no activity and you're not getting any takes, just introduce a little bit of life into your fly by just a standard figure of eight pattern and that'll get your fly moving nicely across the surface of the water like a mayfly when it's about to take off. They're pretty clumsy in take off, especially when they're first hatching, so this is a great way to replicate that with a slow figure of eight retrieve. So you fish those flies across the surface of the water. Now the main important point to make is just pick your fly pattern. There's a variety of different patterns of mayfly. Just look at what's hatching off, take a look at the colours and try and replicate it through your fly. Get those flies on the surface and you'll start getting takes.